say no <laughs> chance in hell in winning that belt back at Survivor Series. You predict in the worst way. You have no shot. Oh, Big Ben, he's the real champion of the family. So, Carla, accept it and present the Loper Belt of Doom to him now and forever. Because, Carla, you are not good at professional wrestling predictions. Ben, I wish you Godspeed and enjoy that championship belt. Yep, that's me. This is my dog's playing in sprinklers. Yeah, this is what I do here. I give you your money's worth. So apparently this is for the Kings of the Ring, the world's first wrestling theme song cover band. Honey, did you hear that? It's wrestling first, I'm sorry, the world's first wrestling theme song cover band. They have a Halloween show Friday, 11-1, not on Halloween, that's weird, at the Amityville Music Hall in Long Island, New York. And it says it's Guar plus wrestling, basically. Not exactly sure how that mixes, but it's crazy theatrics, comedy, costume impressions, and they battle the audience. Probably not safe, but that's what they do. So here's to you, Kings of the Ring. Good luck. This is one of my signature stairs, as you call it. dogs are running through the sprinklers, so I very much apologize. I don't know if you can see that. Yep. My dog running through the sprinkler. So I'll just, I guess, leave that in the frame. As I tell you, uh, thank you for being a huge fan. Uh, your girlfriend wanted me to leave you a very funny and encouraging message about pushing through after your house burned down, and I'm very, very, very sorry about that, but uh, I don't know if I can be really funny at this time other than watching my dogs play in the sprinkler. So here's about, uh, we're going on a minute of that, I'm not really sure how I'm going to get them back in the house since it's about 8.30 here, and yeah, this is my life here, my dogs love sprinklers. So I really hope this is encouraging and funny for you. Uh, I don't know if it is. Yeah, here you go. Just a couple of idiots, Kyle. Well, thank you for being a huge fan, and uh, <laughs> hope you enjoyed this message. Kyle Custer, this one's for you, my friend. Keep pushing through. Keep your head up. And squeeze what is around you, and that's your girlfriend because she's a very good, very good person. Kirk Sheaf, your buddy Vincenzo says that you're a huge fan of mine. He wanted me to give you a shout out. He also says that you're a huge fan of Larry, which I don't exactly understand. I don't think you know who Larry is. And I think it's going to be impossible for me and Larry to give you a shout out and to tell you to keep crushing it. Now, I can tell you to keep crushing it. But Larry, who is very, very, very bad at his job, is not available right now and cannot tell you to keep crushing it. But me, Chief, Luke Harper, I 
can tell you to keep crushing it. And thank you for being a big fan. I'm sorry, a huge fan. Also, you have a great friend in Vincenzo. A great, great friend. So you might want to hug him and keep him close. Because that's what great friends are about. Thanks, buddy. Jake Nelson. I hear you're eight years old and you're a WWE super fan. And I also hear that you're a straight A student. That's very impressive. My son Brody, who's also eight years old, is also a straight A student. And I hope that you keep that up because it's very, very important. It's also very impressive. Most importantly, though, I hear that you love the Bludgeon Brothers, Eric Rowan and me, Luke Harper. And that you hope that we beat the crap out of Roman Reigns and Daniel Bryan at Hell in a Cell. Well, I assure you, as long as you keep trying to keep those straight A's up, I will keep trying to beat up Roman Reigns and Daniel Bryan for you, Blake Nelson. So keep it up, and thank you for being a fan.